Hi guys, welcome back to Alice in Yoga Land. Short stories with Alice and Chuck. Today, I will be reading from Little Hindu Deities by Sanjay Patel. Today's story is about Sita. From the very beginning, Sita was quite special as she was literally made from the earth. She was discovered as a baby, divinely born in a furrow of a plowed field, which is why she is thought of as the daughter of the earth goddess. But this farm girl is no country bumpkin. Her saga of abduction and devotion is the epic story the Ramayana has inspired India throughout the ages. Sita, an avatar of goddess Lakshmi, was the central love interest of Prince Rama the seventh incarnation of Vishnu. According to legend, Sita was abducted and imprisoned by the demon king Ravana. After being imprisoned for months in Ravana's palace, Sita was finally rescued by Rama and his army. Returning to the rightful kingdom, Rama and Sita ushered in an era of peace and prosperity. However, Within Rama's court, a rumor emerged, questioning Sita's chastity. During her capture, for the sake and of peace of the kingdom, Rama, Rama gave in to the rumors and as pressure mounted, rejected Sita. Finding no other way to prove herself, Sita walked into a blazing fire to prove her purity. Astonishingly, the god of fire, Agni, did not harm her. Sita returned to Rama intact, but he again put his kingdom's wishes ahead of his own and rejected her loyalty. Tired of Rama's priorities and the injustice of the world, she asked for sanctuary with the earth goddess. All of the gods watched as the earth split open, allowing Sita to descend deep within, never to return. Sita's martyrdom to her duty as a steadfast and faithful wife has left a profound legacy. And this is Sita, I'm Alice, and this is Chuck. Thank you for watching Alice in Yoga Land, and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Say bye, Chuck. Say bye, Chuck. Bye, Chuck. Bye, guys.